Hi everyone, this is Liz from Creative Life of Liz and I'm here planning for the week of September 20th through the 26th. I'm using this kit from Nicole Kelly Creations. I think it's called hmm, Fall Something. I don't I don't remember. You'll see in the title. I'll, I'll figure it out and put it there. Uh, fall Rose maybe, uh, but it's kind of pink and pumpkin-y and I think it's super cute um, and fun for this week. Mostly I'm going to try to use the kit as much as possible, but obviously it's only one page. So I pulled a few washies. Uh, this one is from Michaels and then these two are from AliExpress. My plan is to use these two for the bottom and then also use this one for the middle. And then I'll stick the headers, the blank ones at the top and then today at the bottom, I believe. Mm, nope, we'll swap that today at the top, the other ones at the bottom, and that will cover everything that we need. Um, so that's my plan to stick these down, stick the weekend banner down, stick the other headers down, uh, do all those things. I have my uh, slice tool. I have my correction tape to cover things up. So I'm going to do that stuff and then I will come back and we can do the interesting bits. All right, this gets us all of the like basic setup. As always happens with Nicole Kelly Creations kits, the headers are a little too tall, so I just line them up at the bottom here so that they go up a little into the date space, and then I line them up at the top here so that they go a little into this box and it works out totally fine. Not a big deal. Um, so for this one, hmm. What one I want to use? I think I want to use this one as my quote box. If I can get any of these to pick up, I might just decide they all want to like stay attached forever. You never know. All right, here we go. Oh, I should also know I decided to put the washi over here all the way to the edge, basically. Um, because there's not that much I need in the sidebar this week. So I'm just going to go with that. This is the box I feel most goes with that one. So this is what I'm going to stick over here. Why is it so hard to put down straight? All right, well, that looks pretty good. Uh, let's see. I think I'm going to stick this one next. This one has all kinds of scrappy scraps. There we go. As you can see, this like totally covers up the extra washi and it's like it's not even there. Which is great. Uh, let's me use up some of these washies that are actually too wide to be headers. But they look cute as headers. Alright, there we go. Um, I guess I'm going to stick this one on Tuesday. This one is the one that like reads the most like it. So I'm 
gonna stick this one over here. And then if these two left, I feel like coffee makes sense on Monday, so we're gonna do that. I feel like this one doesn't have like strict requirements about which way it goes, so I'm just gonna go with it. So there are all the boxes done. I think it's looking pretty cute in the sidebar space. Um, I did pull out like my leftover sidebars. I'm not sure that there's like anything that really makes sense. So I might just put them in. So I'm going to start with the pink one because why not? I mean, I can pick it up. doesn't even matter um so nicole kelly creations makes her sidebars way too wide i don't know why um but i just end up trimming off a little from each side and then it ends up like pretty close this one ends up slightly narrow so i'm just gonna stick it like a little on the inside good enough And this one, I'm gonna do the same thing. So I don't even bother to clean off a lot of the scruffy scraps because I'm just gonna trim them off anyway. There we go. Um, so one is gonna be for Pepper's teeth. I'm not even gonna bother filling anything in for that. And then the other one, I need to start stretching every day. Um, in preparation for curling. So these are like meditation Avery's from Creative Tavern Studio, but I feel like they work. So there is that. The rest of this sidebar, I don't really have anything that like needs to go into here. Um, Cause I've pretty much covered the most important bits, <laughs> which are the habit trackers. Um, I do track my meals and all that stuff elsewhere. So it's not super important. I did pull out this American Crafts book and there's this Be Kind Even On Your Bad Days sticker um, that I feel like kind of will go with this kit. Um, so I'm going to stick that one down like so. I'm just going to leave this gap for where the dots are not showing. And then I just have like this little gap right here. Let's see which washi fits better. Look at this one. It's like slightly too wide. So I'm just gonna stick the skinnier one in. Like so. There we go. I think that looks pretty cute actually. So I'm gonna go with that. Move this out of the way. Call it good. Um, for my weekly plans, as you might expect, I don't have a lot of them. <laughs> um, I haven't had a lot of them in quite a while. But I'm going to start with work. I'm just going to like alternate a few of these kind of like functional things. Um, that are included in the kit like so. Also on Monday, uh, let me see if I can find it. There we go. I am going to do my plan with me. So I'm going to just stick one of those down. Oops, wrong one. That goes there. All right, that's the first half of the week. I think that's all I have. And then for the second half of the week, Stick in a couple more of these for work. I feel like personally, I wish that these circles were slightly smaller, but I think it's fine. I don't really have anything important going on. Stick that down. 
There we go. Um, also on Friday, I'm going to use another one of these guys. I'm going to put up my October Bujo setup. By the time you see this video, that will already be up. So feel free to look at that as well. And then down here at the bottom, I am going to stick some washi. I'm going to trim this washi. I'm going to make it make a like pointy arrow. Usually I make them into flax, but they're going to be here through the end of Sunday. My parents are visiting. I should have said that first. Um, so they'll be here through the end of Sunday. So I'm just going to put a pointy arrow. They're driving back on Monday. They're going to get here on Friday probably just before dinner. I think I'm going to use this purple one. If I can get it. I think I'm going to stick it like this. All right. So this is what I have left of the kit that I will be using during the week. And then this is what my pre-planning is looking like. So I think it's starting to look pretty good actually. Um, so stick around for just a second and you can see how the finished spread turned out. All right, here's the finished week. I love how it turned out. It's super calm and kind of cozy feeling. So definitely great. If I don't mention it, it came from the kit from Nicole Kelly Creations. All I have left is two thirds of this one checklist, which I'll throw in my leftovers, but everything else I used from that kit. Um, so these two bottom washies are both from AliExpress. I also used it through here. This is from Creative Cavern Studio. Um, this is from American Crafts, Piper Paper Company, Creative Cavern Studio. Uh, this is a leftover from My Planner Life UK. This is from one of the Recollections books. I'm not sure it's from this year, but the stickers that come in one of the year's books. This is from Piper Paper Company, Creative Cavern Studio, Happy Planner, Happy Planner, Piper Paper Company, and then everything else came from the kit. So I think I really used the kit pretty well, which was great. Um, I got a bunch of things done this week, spent some time with the family, all of that good stuff. So I think it was a pretty good week, and I'm excited to finish up one last fall spread um, in the next week, and then switch over, hopefully for all of October, for Halloween spreads. Um, or at least the weeks that are fully in October before going into like cozy spreads, I guess, for November. We'll see how that goes. We'll see if that's actually ends up being my plan, but that's what I'm thinking about right now. Um, let me know what kits you've been using, uh, what you're excited to be using in the coming weeks or what you're thinking about buying. Let me know about that. I would love to hear. Um, also like and subscribe below. It really helps me out and I really appreciate it. Follow me on Instagram at Creative Life of Liz to see in progress and finished spreads. I tag all the shops, show you bits and pieces of my other planners um, and the rest of my life and all that good stuff. And until next time, bye.